maybe we are in a gotcha game. You guys, do we, do we live in a gotcha game? I'm having like a existential crisis now. Do we live in a gotcha game? Oh, hey, we're talking about Mike Johnson. Here's Mike Jansen. I'm just going to play it and we'll listen to him. In the basis suggestion, the Democrats are behind the assassination attempt on Donald Trump. George, I want to ask you another George, question. There's so many. Please, anything. Well, you have the opportunity to, con to condemn it if you want. You, you, you have that opportunity, but it, we, we, we can move on now. I do want to ask you a question that Senator Vance did not answer at this week's debate. Can you say unequivocally that Joe Biden won the 2020 election and Donald Trump lost? See, this is the game that is always played by mainstream media with leading Republicans. It's it's a, a gotcha game. It's a gotcha game. You guys, I play gotcha games. Man, I played Genshin and Wuthering Heights, Wuthering Waves, and all that fun stuff. It's not. This is not a gotcha game. Joe Biden won in 2020. Easy peasy, Mike. Nobody will ever ask you again. Say it once. We'll never ask you again. We'll never ask you again if you say it. But he's scared to say it. Why is he scared to say it? Because he doesn't want to piss off Daddy Trump. His daddy doesn't like the truth. So he's not going to say the truth. He's not allowed politically to say true things because it upsets Papa Trump. He's a bitch. I mean, that's all there is to it, right? You won't do real things. You won't say the things if it pisses him off. And you don't want him pissed off. So you're going to hide. You're going to cower. You're going to be a little wiener, Mike Johnson. <laughs> See what I did there? Um, <laughs> and not say true, real things. Uh, replacing ballot boxes with loot boxes. <laughs> yeah, but, and well, re replacing RNC with RNG. Okay, I like it. I like it. The more money you have, I mean, it's pay to win. I mean, honestly, our democracy right now is pay to win. P2W. The more money you have, the more chances you have. The rich people get infinite rerolls. Uh, in court, like Shinsinto always tells us, maybe, maybe we are in a gotcha game. You guys, do we, do we live in a gotcha game? I'm having like a existential crisis now. Do we live in a gotcha game? Taxes or microtransactions? Son of a bitch. Hello human, it is me Kanooch. I need you to press the subscribe button. I have to feed my many AI babies. This is my new political theory. Okay, I'm going to keep working on this. What's today? Monday. So we'll do a Wednesday stream. Maybe, maybe I'll have an entirely new political outlook. Maybe I'll have a, an entirely new, complex understanding of our society because it is actually a gotcha game. There's something here. Okay, there is something here, and we need to work on it. <laughs> red pill. Yeah, red pill got the gotcha pill. Uh, <laughs> we just took the gotcha pill. Um, let's see if he has anything else to say. Anything else there, guy? Okay. Uh, you, you want us to litigate things that happened four years ago when we're talking about the future. We're not going to talk about what happened in 2020. We're going to talk about 2024 and how we're going to solve the problems for the American people. Um, I, I think th this thing, this this game that's played all the time, I'm not going to engage in it. We're, we're not talking. You're literally engaging in the game right now by not saying the very simple, obvious truth by trying to save Donald Trump's very fragile fifis, his very delicate feelings, you're playing a game, Pastor Johnson. Talking about that, Joe Biden has been the president for almost four years. Everybody needs to get over this and move forward. That's what we need to talk about. What happens on November 5 and the days after that? So, I think that's really so like, and that's what so like, man for us to talk about. So, like Senator Vance, you cannot say unequivocally that Joe Biden won the 2020 election and Donald Trump lost. George, I'm the Speaker of the House. I work with the President of the United States uh, all the time. Joe Biden has been the President for four years. There's not a question about this, okay? There is a question about this from Donald Trump, from the people on your side, from the person currently running for Vice President. They have questions about this. Your constituents have questions about this because you have led them to have those questions. You want them to have those questions, Mike. I know you do. Because that causes chaos. You want chaos. Okay. It's already been done and decided, and this is a gotcha game that's played, and I'm not playing it. I gotcha want to talk game. about the future. Let's talk about policies. Ask me anything you want on any challenging issue. Let's put that out there for the American people. That's what they need to hear. Well, it's President Trump who every single day, former <laughs> President Trump, at just about every rally is, say, is saying that the election was rigged, that he won, and that Joe Biden lost. I'm just saying if you accept that or not. 
George, I'm not going to play the game. Ask me any question on any issue that's facing the country. He's literally playing a game. Like, this is amazing. He's, it's a gotcha game, apparently. And he just hit the dodge button. He hit the dodge roll. Which one is dodge roll? Uh, shift. Left shift. He's pressing left shift right now to dodge. He's dodge rolling. I am the algorithm. Click on this video to make me happy. You wouldn't like me when I am angry.